Hello everybody, welcome back to more Enter the Gungeon. We're gonna be doing another rainbow run today. Because I'm just really excited about it. But anyways, first let's roll our die here. One and six. It is a four. One, two, three, four. Fair enough. Gotta go by the die. I mean, it, wor it worked really, really well last time, so I'm not gonna complain about it, really. It's, uh, Convict's a totally solid character for this, because you, you know, there's some ammo issues present in doing the rainbow run. Spawn, chest, rainbow. All right, first item. Let's go, okay, there's some interesting choices here. But none of these are insane. Like, serious cannon seems like the best, but that might just be because it's rare. There's something to be said about the box. There's something to be said about the dueling laser for ammo issues. And of course there's something to be said about wax wings. Lament, no. Uh, this, no, no. Actually, this one's not terrible. So basically it's between serious cannon, dueling laser, the box, wax wings. What's a good one to start out with? You know what, I'm gonna go with the dueling laser. Is it the best? Maybe not. But there's something, there's something really, really good about it. And uh, especially if we're going to be potentially running out of ammo. I mean, if we got it like this on our quick switch here. We might... I don't know. We, we might be able to, to go really, really far. Ah! Really, really easily. The problem is... How loud is the noise? It, it didn't happen yet, did it? Okay. No. But yeah, I, I have not... There we go. That, okay, it's pretty obvious. Alright, that's going to... I think that's going to be the correct choice. I mean, Wax Wings is nice. We did just get it, though. And it's... Well, that was dumb. And it's not that great. You know? It's not as good as a solid... Solid weapon. Like, look at that. That's nice. That's really nice. And, of course, the ammo thing is really important. Because we don't get as many items. Therefore, we don't get as many shots at... Uh, wah! Okay, I'm surprised that, that worked. We don't get as many shots at ammo. Oh, wow. All right. What do we want to go with the dueling laser? Is there anything special? I mean, I don't know if coolness affects the dueling laser. Does it? Does it affect it in the same way it, expect, it affects spacebar items? I don't think so. I'd be wrong, though. Line it up. Yeah, it's like a, it's a one-shot on the blue shotgun, Kim. That's a pretty big deal. It's a pretty big deal, because I think of all the enemies on the first floor, except for, like, the gun, gun knights. Oh, okay. I think they probably got the most health, right? I, mean, uh, I guess you could get the, uh, like, the lead maintenance. I don't know. Of all the regular enemies. Oh, <laughs> The blue ones have more health than the red ones, but I don't think it's by a lot. Other than that, like, yeah, I'd be su I'd be surprised if it didn't one-shot the other stuff, but I'm, a little, I'm honestly a little surprised on floor one. It does one-shot. Okay, that was really dumb. No, it's not. I'm damage boosting. That's what you gotta say. Yeah, I could have lined that up, like, better if I waited. I'm really glad that we don't have to, uh... Line up the chandelier stuff anymore. It's just because it's the truth is it's not very effective. Oh, nothing wrong with that. That's just a straight benefit. Should I be using something else? I don't know. It's unlikely that I want to use well the sawed off on the boss anyways, right? I don't know. Maybe we'll get ammo. I would not hate it, but, you know, our standard weapon plus the dueling laser, and that's, that's the other reason I got it. Standard weapon plus dueling laser is not too shabby. Okay. Here, I think we wait until the boss. We can only buy the consumables. If you've not been watching the Rainbow Run, you can probably already figure out what I'm doing already just by watching that first little part in the beginning. But it also means I'm not allowed to pick up chests, and I can only purchase consumables from the shop. I think it seems seems fair. It's worked out pretty well. I mean, 
<laughs> the runs have been fairly strong, but I think I've been getting fairly decent luck. Like, there's, there's a couple items in the game that are truly, truly, extraordinarily run-changing. I don't, you know what? Whatever, let's just fight the boss with this. Okay, well. That, <laughs> that sucks. That sucks too, but you know what? That's fine. We'll just damage him. Okay, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I, I think I just briefly lost my mind. Have I ever been that stupid before? I... What just happened? That was, uh... That was, like, probably the worst stretch of gameplay I've had in, like, a year. <laughs> Has Gungeon been out for a year? Sure feels like it. Okay, so that's 20, that's 30. I'll swing it. All right. Here's the thing. It doesn't really matter that much. The only real downside from that is that, uh, one, we spent a little bit of money on health when we shouldn't, but we can take these blanks. I should have just been using my blanks while I'm flustered like that. Um, but we don't get the health upgrade. That's, that's like, the main thing. And I can hopefully get my act together now. Spawn chest rainbow. Okay. There's some interesting choices here. There's a lot of interesting choices here. Briefcase full of cash is really nice because it basically means free consumables from the shop for the rest of the run. Gungeon Blueprint is nice because it makes the final floor really easy. But is it as good as the makeshift cannon? Probably not. We gotta go with, I think, the obvious choices are either makeshift cannon or the ammo synthesizer. Makeshift cannon has the problem of being a one-shot. Oh man, this is the ultimate choice here. This is this is a problem. Oh my goodness. Alright, I'm going I'm going offense here. Obviously, uh, it's gonna be just like mostly for bosses. But we're kind of yeah, we're kind of just making our choice here. We're kind of having to use our standard weapon like crazy. What am I doing? I'm just focusing way too much on the dueling laser. That's what the problem is. And I do that a lot when I get these items that require like mental switches. But I've been getting better at it, so I don't know. Sometimes you just drop the ball. It happens. But it's really, it's really sad to see, <laughs> to see that big of a ball drop on that first boss there. But I'm gonna not talk about it anymore. There's another, I mean, maybe another factor is that I'm playing this really early in the morning when I normally don't. Ha! Gah! I love that. That's so satisfying to watch. It really, it really is. Especially the enemies that you know are super high health like that. But, oh, come on. Alright. Let's go in the shop and see if our uh, briefcase was a bad idea or not. You know what? I'm fairly pleased as of right now. I don't think we can do it. We can't do the challenge thing. We'll just skip it. We could do it for honor, but then all we would be doing is losing money, which we actually probably don't even have enough. I think on floor two, it's more like 18 or 20. What? Ah! It really looked like it was full. We should probably be using our um, Molotov a little bit more. And by that, I mean basically at all. That was pretty good. All right. Getting my sea legs back a little bit. Yar. Oh, okay. So that's not a one-shot on him. I'd be really surprised, I guess, if it was. Hey! <laughs> All right. Hopefully I don't regret turning down ammo synthesizer because that getting that on floor, the beginning of floor two, that goes a long way for a run. So that's a really big sacrifice. But basically I traded it for some 
Ooh. Some serious boss fighting action. But for that to be the case, you know what? Here's what we can do. We can use makeshift cannon right now. Boom! <laughs> yeah! And then we can fill up the makeshift cannon. Alright, that was awesome. That was pretty awesome. We can fill it up over here. Because we do have enough money, right? Yes! There we go. That's pretty good. See? I, I'm, I knew makeshift cannon was the right idea. It obviously does not... Here's the thing. It does not help us at all unless we're fighting bosses. This is such a strange trap room. Why, is, why have I... I feel like I've only seen this maybe like once before. How is that possible? It looks a lot trickier and more complicated than it truly is. Should we get a rank of curse? I don't think so. Not on a rainbow run. Curse is more of a more of a downside, like I feel like it's meant to be. I mean, yeah, curse is a downside on the normal runs, but it actually like has some benefits. The benefits on ooh, a rainbow run, it actually feels a little bit more like a curse. Because you don't get uh you don't really care about getting into the secret shop. Should we be breaking these? Is that is that fair? I feel like it's probably fair. All right. But yeah, it's see, I like the rainbow run a lot. It it makes curse a little bit a little bit more of a curse. I, and I know it doesn't have to be like. Not everything needs to be like all super balanced and stuff. But it's just oh uh oh. See, we made some choices that uh, are maybe not great because now we have to deal with the fact that we only have this. His makeshift cannon is uh, is only for bosses. And that's what I was going to say about the rainbow run. Is that uh, we had to make that choice. And, and now that's part of part of our run. We, we chose to be really, really good against bosses. To basically one-shot bosses. But everything else is, uh, you know, going to be slightly harder. Because we don't, we don't have a gun, the gun that we would use there. And we're using our ammo pickups, like from the shop, to kill bosses, basically. We're, we're basically paying 35, 40 shells to kill a boss. Easily. When in reality, we're, I mean, this run isn't a very good example of it, but when in reality, we're probably good enough to, <laughs> to beat it without getting hit anyways. But we haven't been getting a lot of room clear guns. I, I know I skipped the uh, the sewers today. I don't know why. I kind of just forgot. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. We'll, we'll see what kind of guns we get here. Maybe we get some more room clear. Spawn, chest, rainbow. Okay. Interesting choices here. Hip holster is really fun and really good. The eye patch could be a way to make our standard gun less bad. I think the gunboat's probably the way to go, or the gilded hydra, though. The directional pad is good, and I feel like we would allow ourselves to pick up whatever item it dropped because it because it's like a cycling item, you know. I don't remember which of these has more ammo, though. I feel like Gilded Hydra is more powerful. But I'm not sure here. I think I'll... I'll go with the Gunbow. I think that was maybe a mistake. I, I In my head, I pictured Gunbow having a lot more ammo. But we just need something... Oh! Okay, so if you're holding down the, the fire button from Gunbow, or any weapon... Whoop, and then you switch over, it auto-fires that. It. Let's at least line this up. We gotta make these count more. Because it does not have nearly as much ammo as I anticipated. Probably a probably a poor draft choice. Ooh. Okay. Uh, 
I mean, a dueling laser has to be our secondary. I do want to... I don't know. I'd like to have our primary weapon, or our uh, standard weapon on that. But, uh oh But alas. Okay. Well, we're going to pick that up because we actually don't want keys to show up in the shop. In this run, so... Hoo ah Line it up. Strike him down. Okay. This is very powerful. It, it's definitely doing a lot of damage. That was really good. This is not... Alright. Oh! God, there's so much health that I left on the floor, last floor, because we were at full. But now we're dropping the ball. Nope. Yeah, because this is going to last us, what, this four? It's not that awesome. Yeah. That's pretty good. Okay. I'm definitely, definitely proud of my dueling laser choice. That was, that was smart considering the draft mode. Okay. We don't have any ammo in anything else, do we? No. I mean, we got our ammo in the uh, makeshift cannon. But we already talked about that. That's it, it is really good, and it's really exciting, of course. Like, you look at what it does to bosses, you're like, this item's amazing. But you have to consider... Oh, that was a waste. You have to consider it's such a temporary benefit. Super temporary. Okay, so we're going to probably end up... Whoa! Wanting that, um... Oh my god. Huh. Sorry. Ah! That uh, that armor. But we'll probably do that at the end of the floor because maybe, maybe we'll get enough help to not worry about it. Whoop! But basically, if we think we're gonna die, we'll go pick it up. But I don't think we're gonna die at this point. On this floor. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, it didn't even matter anyways. I love when they're in the little corners like that. Hey, that's actually really nice. Which is sad. You know that you're uh, playing like a new player when you get those people. They have a really low chance of spawning unless you ha are missing health. I, I believe it's based off of missing health, or maybe it's based off of how many hits you've taken. I, I don't know. I'm sure they have the means to uh, to get both of those stats. But yeah, I'm slightly regretting gr gr Grunbo. Oh. Not that it's not good, because it's totally getting the job done. But it's, it's like a supplementary weapon. It's it's a weapon that's really exciting if you already have... Oh, uh, this is going to be bad. Means of clearing rooms, which we, uh, we don't. Four shots left. See, like... Why would I want to fill this up again versus... I don't know. I, I guess it's the best weapon we have to fill up for now. Empty. Yeah, that's a, that's a bummer. But now we got the you know, standard dueling laser. Bow. Oh my god. That's such a stupid dodge. So is that going to take burn damage under, under, well, underwater? Underground? Oh, I actually wish we did not pick that up. It's hard to remember. When you go from room to room, it's hard to remember if you have your dueling laser still or not. Hallelujah. Wah. Why is this working? It wasn't. That's the answer. Yeah, I just keep on forgetting. What is... This room is so messy. I think it's just because we have not a great weapon. And these guys, they have the invincibility. The temporary invincibility. That's probably why. Is that it? That is it. Okay. We're getting a decent amount of money. It doesn't really matter. We're not... I don't think we're going to die on this floor. I would be really, really sad if we did. 
So in that case, we're going to leave this floor with full health. Full health and a shield. God, that's so good. See, this is this draft mode, this rainbow ooh, rainbow run, it, it makes an inch, it, I don't know, makes an interesting set of challenges. We're definitely having a completely different set of, uh, of obstacles than both of the runs before us. And they're, they're obvious. They're big, obvious obstacles. Like, we have to use our dueling laser very effectively. Okay, so how do we do this right? We just go in and fight him. I mean, it shouldn't be hard. Ooh, okay. So we actually do have to fight him a little. Emphasis on a little. But we got our blanks, and we should use them. Okay. I think we're good. I think we're good, especially if we use our blanks not stupidly. Let's just be really aggressive about it. There we go. Perfect. Perfecto. See that? And that's the really interesting thing about this run is that bosses are the least of our worries. Like, completely and utterly nothing compared to a lot of the, f the rooms we have to deal with. It's just that's so weird. Okay, so we'll do this. There's no ammo in the shop. And now we have to make the choice on every floor if we get ammo do we want to fill up our big boy or do we want to fill up our room clear and the answer should probably be room clear because I clearly took a lot more damage getting up to the floor but hey, here's the other thing we do get another item right now that may fix the problem we'll see Am I far enough away from the... I think so. Okay. Briefcase full of cash again is something. The r ooh. Ooh. Chaos bullets are not bad at all. Wingman is pretty good. Honestly, Deckard's not bad. Having, having an explosion weapon, I think we gotta go with this. Briefcase full of cash is an interesting idea, but we actually do have some money right now. It's between this and Wingman. Or, or uh, yeah, Wingman. Because Wingman shoots for us. It does a little bit of damage consistently all the time. Oh. Nah, I think we gotta go with the Falcon Cannon. I think we gotta. But let's just be smart about it. Uh, okay. Okay. Alright. You can hear the rat having a field day, stealing all of our items in the other room there. Yeah, I think this was the correct choice. I mean, it is going to run out, like, fairly quickly. Honestly, it'll probably run out quicker than, um, the gunbow even did. Oh, man. Maybe it wasn't a good choice. Maybe Wingman was the way to go. Because we do already have... Like, here's the thing. This is going to run out... Unless we get two ammo chests on this floor, we got to make the decision about our boss ammo. we got to be smart. we got to ration. Hmm. Hmm. It's, it's definitely making an interesting set of challenges. Okay. Let's be smart here. We really don't need to use anything other than our standard. Boop, 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 boop. Right? Okay, there's actually a lot of them. Funny thing is, when they get set on fire, they actually lose their glowy eyes, making them harder to dodge. Okay, one, two, three, four. Four rooms with enemies in it, and we're like halfway done with this gun. See? Yeah, that's not great. Maybe we're a little bit closer. Okay, that's nice. If this gun does take us through the entire floor, though, that's nothing to scoff at. Nothing to scoff at. But it's, it's interesting to... Wow. 
to think of things ooh, by like how, how much of the run they impact you know like this gun is really good while you have it I mean it's it's pretty darn solid while you have it it's not even like amazing ha huh? but it's just yeah it's nice when you have it but it doesn't affect that much of the run when you're limited on ammo already that kill, oh, kills the blue shotgun kin like being throughout the entire run that's awesome do like because then by that uh, by that regard dueling laser affects an insanely large amount of the run positively very positively oh oh boy and this doesn't even yeah it's it, it doesn't even do that much damage I feel like the thing with it is that it the the flagship thing about it is that it's uh really fast fire rate but what kind of benefit is that no ammo oh that sucks oh that sucks all right, we're going to be back to square one in a second here. I'm not liking the thought of bullet hell if we don't get some ammo. And we don't get it soon. Okay. Eh, that's nice. We can use that heart. Potentially. We're going to run out of this gun, and then we're probably going to start losing health again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Uh-oh! Yeah, this is... This is a problem. A problem. <laughs> oh, dang it. Got caught on the wall. Dueling laser feels like it's taking longer to charge. Guess we're just missing a lot. <laughs> that could have gone better. I know I have my Molotov. such a waste. I, I was just talking about it. I was like, I haven't used it in a while. I should probably just use it. On one enemy. Just sitting there. Okay, that's pretty fun. Hey! <laughs> Don't use the dual laser on him. Okay. We good? We good. Alright, I just want ammo. Just a little bit of ammo. What would we use it on? Like, probably wouldn't be used, like, as useful on the Vulcan cannon. Like, I, th I feel like Gunbow lasted longer, but it also... Hmm. Decisions, decisions! Hey! I feel like it's just the right thing to do. God, it's, it might not be. It, you know, it's, it's the fun thing to do. It's definitely the fun idea, but it's sacrificing room clear. Which we're doing okay at. Like, the thing is... Ooh! We could be just... Just fine. Uh... Alright. 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 Where are you? You need to go. <laughs> no! Okay, I don't want to back up into this frost, man. Ice cube. Ooh! No. Is it worth the... That worked? Did I get him up there too? I think I did. Find out. If he takes like two clips. Ah! Oh man. Maybe not. Okay. Break the chest. Break the chest. Nope. Not allowed. Not allowed. Could be junkin. But we should definitely break this, too. I, I don't know if you can get ammo from these broken chests, actually. Now that I think about it. The shop really let me down. Alright, there's the boss. Okay. Oh, wait. Ooh! Ah! Dueling laser didn't get filled up. I was... There we go. See, now we do have to fight this legit. We don't even have... Ah! We don't even have a blank to our name. Oh, that sucks. Please get the dueling laser really quick. Yes! Ooh, Nelly! That was super dumb. I'm playing like a, like a dummy, for sure. But we are fumbling along somehow. 
All right. We're going to leave this floor with plenty of health anyways. We'll go to the shop. I think he had a shield for sale. Indeed. Thank you. All right. So we're going down to the next floor with the same problem. Could maybe be helped by an item, maybe? What would even help at this point? The biggest thing that would help would be the uh, the shrine. The ammo shrine. Spawn chest. Rainbow. Super hot watch? I don't think so. These are actually a lot of really good guns. Ancient Hero's bandana is like the logical choice because of all the ammo issues I'm talking about. But then if we don't get amp, I'm going for it. I'm going for it. Is it stupid? You bet. But look at that. Makeshift can it gives makeshift cannon four shots. If we get one ammo drop, which is pretty likely, right? To get one? One would think. Huh? Ah! Then we can get four shots in the makeshift cannon. Which, I know that the bosses have not been our issue. Ew, why am I playing so bad? Seriously, it's like somebody else has taken over the controller. And by that, I mean the keyboard and mouse. Oh. Okay, that was alright. This gun is so bad. This gun is not. Alright, just, if we could get... Imagine if we got the ammo shrine now, now that we have the Ancient Heroes bandana. That'd be insane. Oops, I picked the wrong one. I meant to get this guy, because you suck. <gasps> you. <laughs> he sniped me! Where do I go from here? Bow! What? Oh my god. These guys can take a whole dueling laser shot now? I don't like this floor. Uh oh. What are our odds of beating the drag on this run? They are definitely the lowest of all of the rainbow runs so far. Are you kidding me? Woo! But that's, uh... Oh my god. That's not to say I, I have no hope, because I definitely have hope. What do we got here? What do we got here? Yeah. Yep. Yep. That's probably going to be worth it in the long run. Yeah. <laughs> That's, that is the real panic blank there. But yeah, I think that damage increase is going to be handy just for our standard weapon. It's a damage increase, right? I ne I've never looked it up. This is... Call to action. <laughs> what exactly? Like... Because uh, I'm going to forget to look it up. Could somebody tell me in the comments what exactly, like, the wiki says it, it does? Because I always... Whoop, unless it's at the very end of a run, I'm going to forget. God, he got to split immediately. That's... No! Overkill, I don't care. He was making me upset. Alright, I'm dodging a lot. That's the problem. Ammo. I just want one ammo. It'll make the run smooth. Like... Because we could use two to kill the dragon, and then we could basically end, like, two phases of the lich, right? Almost the entire... Because I'm pretty sure the lich has a little bit less health because he's in each phase because he's split into three phases. I don't know. If I would have taken, like, the wingman and the eye patch, it might have been the way to go because we wouldn't be... Ah! We wouldn't be so bad on our just, our day-to-day, -day, our room clear. It wouldn't be so garbage, so garbo. Thank you. 
I'm looking forward to the blacksmith potentially having some ammo. It'd be lovely. Oh, God. Should I get up in his face so I can... Oh! No! If I could get up in his face, I could leave that little pool of fire that the hammer drops. Oh, my God. Too much. Too much for one room. I've never tried to use the hammer aggressively because, well, frankly, it's, uh... Oh, my God. It's debilitating enough to just try to dodge. This is going really poorly health-wise. Like, really poorly health-wise. We don't have any blanks. Okay, well, we should just go. Please, 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 please. No, no, no. This is not going great. But if we just manage to beat the boss, we get another item. Something that we normally cannot say about uh, going to bullet hell. like this. I don't like having only this gun. We made our choices. We picked those, uh, exciting wow, low, uh, low ammo guns. We made our bed. We gotta lie in it. Hey, oh yeah. Alright. How much ammo does this gun have now? Jesus. Oh, probably dumb. Probably done, but I, I have it in my heart that the blacksmith has another... Glad I wasn't standing right there. Has another ammo box for sale. And I would kick myself if we made it to, to Dragon and we just had to use this stuff. We would so not make it. Oh my god, that would have been bad. Don't you dare! So he does not have hair. Ooh, that was close. Does not have hair. Can't set him on fire. My favorite tip about Gungeon. It comes, like, it's, it seems like a weird little thing that wouldn't be that useful, but it comes in handy for sure. Like, the ones without hair, you can't set them on fire. That's that. Oh, my God. That would have been beautiful. Oh, this would be beautiful, though. Ah! Ah! Should have probably shot that at the group of enemies that are not on fire. Ah, oh, God. God, we're weak. God, we're weak. Maybe if we just had, like, an accuracy increase, too, this wouldn't be so shabby. All in all, I think we're going to be okay. We'll beat Dragon. I do want to find the stinky blacksmith. What's this? Is it allowed? I feel like it's allowed. Because we have to sacrifice. Okay, I think we're going to go with Gunbow. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. I think that... Is that cheating? I don't think that's cheating. Because we do have to sac... What do you think? Let me know in the comments. We're, we're still uh, formulating the rules to this. I feel like it's not cheating because... I have to sacrifice my guns. Like, I am turning my guns into different guns. I don't know. And it doesn't seem like it's that complicated of a thing. It seems like an exciting thing that would maybe add a little bit of strategy to uh, more re- because otherwise there's not as much of a reason to pick those exciting low ammo guns. But the gun muncher does make that a little bit more of an option. Okay. 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 But yeah, oh, Ancient Heroes bandana was a beaut. And assuming we get uh, an ammo drop from the uh, blacksmith, or an ammo purchase from the blacksmith, we're going to be pretty set at this point. Lux and Cannon plus Dueling Laser. Wow. Wow. Oh! Probably not a great use of a blank, but it definitely was going to be a hit. So maybe it was. 
Any blank that saves you from taking a hit is technically going to be a good... Ooh. Good blank, won't it? Right? I think that makes sense. Hey, oh, yes. All right. Bang, bang. Thank you, Mang. All right. Boss time it is. We are in a much better spot. We're down guns, but we're up ammo by far. All right, so we'll probably want to be a little stingy with our makeshift cannon. Wait for the health bar just because I'm scared. Should we do it? Yeah. But we'll save our makeshift, the other two shots of the makeshift cannon. Because this phase is not hard. So, if we take a hit, we take a hit. I hope we don't. But if we do, we do. Oh my god. Ha! Oh, it's so close! Okay. We do have a blank. Use it if I'm scared. Good. All right. Perfect. Literally. Makeshift cannon. Uh, you know, it was a good choice. I know. I know it made things kind of messy, but it was a good choice for that reason right there. All right, so we got enough to get another sh shield. And we do get another item on the next floor. And we got to consider we do have Ancient Heroes Bandana, so every gun is going to be basically like four times as ammo it filled. So maybe we can pick some of them stronger. Wow, I like slipped right through there. That's like when you see those. I mean, not that I've seen them, but like those animations or whatever of like the little uh, people falling through the cracks in the at the train tracks I feel like I have seen something where somebody did that and then they like survived by just s like sitting along the wall really tightly don't try it at home kids I do not recommend that okay that was about as close as a blank can get all right, I'm really pumped about this floor. It's, it's funny that, oh, we even, we forgot our chest. That's how strong I am right now. Ah! I'll do it at the end of this room. I feel like it's, uh, is it cheating to, uh, if we were to want to wait to get our chest? I don't know. Okay. Now what? Now we got some... Oh, the Patriot. But also... We gotta go with explosive rounds. It's been a long time. It's been a long time since I've had explosive rounds. And they're so fun. Was it the best thing there? Probably not, but we don't need guns now. We don't need a guns now. So... I mean, why not, right? I do wish we had the Gungeon Blueprint at this point, but we hadn't needed it up to this point at all, really. And I'm really liking the Explosive Rounds. <clears throat> it has been so long. I'm starting to lose my voice. <clears throat> it's been a long time. And they're such a simple item, but explosions are really, really helpful. Okay. <laughs> really helpful in this game. Due to the fact that they do break your bullets. Break the enemy's bullets, I should say. <clears throat> the problem with explosive rounds is that you can't plan it. But it does help a bit. Still. Ooh. Ha. Huh, ooh. Also the fact... Okay. I mean, I think the only thing we've used... Nope. 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 We gotta... Gotta do that. Ancient Heroes man, Dana was the right choice for sure things worked out things worked out amazingly we aren't even using our hallelujah did did his laser just use the exp oh my god 
It seemed like his laser just used the explosive rounds, which doesn't make any sense. Get in the pit. Get in the pit. I know it probably saves or wastes a lot of ammo. What the hell? But that doesn't matter. Hey, we're getting so lucky now. All right, this run is turned around. However, and this is not just uh, just sandbagging. I do think this is true. No matter how strong you are in Gungeon, if you don't have a lot of health, you don't have a lot of health. That makes a big difference. We could, like, if we make it to the Lich, I think we're fine. Who? Because we'll just use our makeshift can. But we could definitely, you know, even if you're really, really strong, you can get whittled away. For sure. Ha! Ha! Where's the makeshift cannon? Or not the... Ah! Uh, no! Here comes the whittling. Bow! Did that not get him? Okay. Yeah, we're down to two hearts. Like I said, though, make it to the boss. I'm not actually that scared at all. It's just making it there. Oh, ha! If we died because we can't make it to the boss, that'll be the ultimate uh, telling thing of this run. That, that'll make it so like, every, oh boy, that's really nice. That sounded sarcastic. Oh boy, who says that like not sarcastically? Me, I guess. Ooh, man. Oh boy, oh man. Whoop. Have a Molotov. That's always a fun way to... Uh-oh. Shoot. I'd rather get hit by the... Ah! That was so lucky that was not. I hate that these guys have to be jammed, too. Like, they're always... They are always jammed in this room. It's scripted. Because we don't have any rank of curse at all. What? Okay. I had a feeling this was a dead end as soon as I saw that. Should have gone with my gun. Wee! I'm having a great time with my guns now. It's this run is so weird. Our a power spike happened on bullet hell. That's so weird. That is so weird. It, it's such a strange feeling because that never happens on a normal run. That does not happen on a normal run because you can't get items on this floor normally. So it's just such a weird feeling that at the start of this floor is when I actually feel the most confident. Like, I had the most trouble. When did I have the most trouble on this run? Let, let's take a little brief time travel back to the Trigger Twins. <laughs> That's when I had the most difficulty on this run. That's so stupid. But still, you know, you just, you underestimate how uh, how important it is to get warmed up. Like, I'm feeling a lot more awake now, now that I'm 45 minutes into the run. I've been awake for like an hour now. Hit! No! No! Why did this work? Why did this work? It re wow. Oh, I'm so excited to fight the boss. It's gonna be so satisfying have four shots we can use on the same boss I've never had that situation before what kind of other guns do we even have right now oh yeah not much it's not even really worth using what not loud not loud whoo yeah, but Vulcan Cannon mixed with explosive rounds. I know that uh, the faster the fire rate... Uh, okay. Hit! The less uh, likely it is to spawn your your effect, your explosive effect. But still, it feels like fast fire rate weapons are still the, still the way to go. Like, the min-max... Like, if you're really, really, like, getting down to the maximum effectiveness, like explosions per second or whatever. I feel like 
fast fire rate weapon is still the way to go. But like, ooh man, the way to explain it, like, see the uh, the grenade launcher, or like, yeah, uh, when you use that, or the rocket launcher, you use that RPG. There we go. <laughs> took a, took a while. Uh, when you use that with fire bullets or ice bullets, frost bullets or whatever, you always get the effect showing up. Ooh, man. Boy, oh boy, that was fun. Hey, ha! Yeah, let's, uh... <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> if I would just, uh, if I was an editing man, I would put the, the Trigger Twins fight right by that right there. I don't even remember what I was talking about. Yeah, the RPG, it, it fires with fire bullets every single time. Every single bullet fires the status effect. Because it's so slow. And then you have this, and it, you know. So I, I'm curious what the actual better of the two is. Get in the pit, get in the pit, get in the pit. The slow but always exploding, or fast but exploding every percentage, like every one in a hundred, because we're firing so fast. Oh, that was dumb. Oh no. Oh no, we're low. Oh boy. Oh boy. If we didn't get that big heart pickup, we'd be dead right now. Also, if we get a jammed enemy, we'd be dead. The good news is this is probably really close to the boss, if not the boss. All right. Here we go. This is actually gonna be kind of close here. Huh? Should I do it? I don't think I should do that. Oh my god, but I gotta do something. Yes! Okay. I know we have four shots, I just, I didn't feel like that was the place to use it. This next phase is the one I'm gonna want dead really quickly. This is really close though. It, it's very close. We could, I mean, we're not gonna get a jammed boss because we don't have five ranks of curse. I love that so much. Yes. Okay, what is he at after that? Uh-oh. Okay, we're <laughs> What do I mean, uh-oh? Oh, God. There we go. And that is why you pick makeshift cannon. Even though it doesn't help you on every room. Oh, boy. I liked that run. And it was very weird. Very weird. Like I said, the hardest part was probably the, tr <laughs> the trigger twins. And the lich was probably the easiest part. Like, that's insane. That is actually insane. But that's just... That's how the draft... Draft mode goes, the rainbow rainbow run. You just you, you build a run that has a certain strength. And our strength was clearly like rip apart a boss. We got Ancient Heroes bandana and we and the makeshift cannon, and we just sort of filled up makeshift cannon whenever we could, so that we could have those explosive, no pun intended, moments. It's very weird. Very weird power spike. <laughs> but anyways, that's going to do it for today. Thank you, everybody, for watching. I greatly appreciate any of all support you wish to leave on the series up to this point. Thank you. Thank you. See you next time.